Uh, Martin Ryan's my name. I'm the CEO for Meta CDN. We're the enterprise CDN for any online business. The problem we solve is we make websites go fast. User frustration from slow, from slow loading websites is something we've all experienced. 10 seconds doesn't seem that long, but when we're sitting there looking at the site, it seems to take ages. After three seconds, research tells us that we start to lose interest. From 10 seconds onwards, the vast majority of users abandon sites. The consequence is declines in direct sales, conversions, and downstream brand loyalty and repeat visits are also affected. The cause of this is the increasing demand for rich content being loaded up onto websites. Images, embedded video, social media is mandatory, even other assets, and most importantly, the actual web code required to download and run the site. The vast majority of businesses online are unable to access for reasons of complexity, price, or low quality options to solve their problem. MetaCDN solves this problem. Our patent pending technology delivers high performance, scalable, consistent global, global speed around, uh, around websites around the world. Our technology optimises content uh, content locations, storage locations from cloud platforms in any location around the world and dynamically blends that for price, performance and availability to deliver to any user location. Our business model is we, we charge a monthly subscription combined with a pay as you use traffic fee which declines with volume. Setting up and ease of use is core to our DNA. From setup to full integration is a matter of minutes and we've implemented plugins for leading content management and e-commerce platforms. So how are we performing to date? In June 2012, we released our production platform. And with limited online marketing, we rolled out globally. We've identified customers across multiple segments and use cases all around the world who are using the platform. In addition to these, we've had some interesting side, pieces, side feedbacks on different use cases. We've had requests to live stream a funeral, We've had requests to deliver content to a global surf camp site, personal preference of mine. And we've also had a, a global, uh, a well-known uh, global media entity and, and songwriter looking to release albums on their, on their new, new release sites um, sometime in the future to have that delivered around the world. So a broad, broad set of use cases, what is the common thread? Ease of use, availability and scalability come out most on top. Pricing is certainly important, but not necessarily the highest point of, of preference. Accessing MetaCDN starts at a very, very low entry point. An equivalent entry point for a traditional CDN from $200 a month could range to $50,000 a year with a pre-commit. So it's a very, very compelling and significantly different price point. Interestingly enough, our, price, our starting price points are generally cheaper than the traditional CDN to start with. In October 2003, we announced our A round from Starfish Ventures, and our chairman Tony is on the panel today. Tough questions to come, I'm sure. And we, for, with that funding, we plan to use uh, for our expansion into offshore markets and, and expand and enhance some of our product development. Cisco predicts over the next five years that more than more than half of the internet traffic, consumer internet traffic, will be video or high demand services, being accessed being accessed by some 19 billion devices over 300 million websites. We think that our opportunity is significant. In addition, the impact of e-commerce, a $1.4 trillion market, and the move from the cause of SaaS moving offline applications online will have a significant impact, which is still unclear. We're looking to expand our team. Uh, we're seeking to hire developers here in Australia. We're looking to, to take on sales and support team for the rest of, for the, rest of the world. Thanks very and much. And that was my last slide. <laughs>